What's going on everybody? Eat all the birds. I've got something big and scary down the front of my pants that I'd like to share with you. Alright, the Urban Carry Concealed Holster. 65 bucks, two week waiting period. Ordered it from urbancarry.com and I also got the belt with it. Really cool belt. I needed one anyway. Decent price. Really nice. Here's how it works. This thing goes down the front of your pants and it's, in my opinion, I've never carried down the front of my pants before, a pistol down the front of my pants before. It's better than in the waistband, in my opinion. Now this, this thickness of this Galco goes right in my waistband. And it, it bothers me. It's kind of easy to draw when you're sitting down, but other than that, wearing it all the time, it prints. It can hurt a little bit. You know it's there. This thing goes down the front of my pants. Doesn't print, can't see it. No matter how you bend or move, uh, sitting down and drawing it makes it a little bit harder, but it still works. Um, I dig it. The only thing that goes in your waistband is this portion of it right here. The gun starts here and goes down. So the gun is not in your waistband. It doesn't increase the size of your waistband any more than, say, an inch, as opposed to whatever that is. More than an inch. All right, so you grab this thing with one hand, yank it out, it exposes the pistol, you grab it with the other hand, party on. That's how this thing works. Shove it back in the same way, clamp it down, and that's about it. Let's take a look at the holster. I got this one in black. It comes with an ID card holder. I'm not interested in that, but it's there. All right, the leather. As far as I can tell, pretty high quality. The stitching looks nice, and it doesn't look like it's going to fail. It's soft, but it definitely looks like a good piece of material that's been put together by somebody who knows what they're doing. Like I said, this is how much goes in your waistband. This is all below your waistband, so that's not too, too bad. It's not that much different than the Galco I'm used to. It is smaller but it's softer. This doesn't give at all. So it is comfortable. Like I said, sitting down, um, I can draw, but I moan like a pregnant woman, but I can do it. If you're a skinny guy, you would have an advantage. I've got a, a little bit of a gut and uh, does not help. So anyway, like I said, you pull up on this, exposes the pistol, grab it with the other hand, bang, 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 and it goes back in the same way. Pretty easy. They've got a really good video on it on urbancarry.com. They spent some really good time, and uh, I recommend you go watch that. But 65 bucks, if you don't like carrying in the waistband, um, you don't want to carry a shoulder holster, which I wouldn't. Ankle carry, no way. Off the body carry, like in another bag. I don't carry a purse normally, so that's not an option. This has been working. Summer's coming. I don't know what's going to happen. Having this piece of leather down the front of my pants... I don't know. I don't know if that's going to work at all. So this might be a two-season carry, three-season carry. I'm not sure. I'll do another review after, I don't know, a couple months. I've had it about a week, maybe a little bit more. I've carried it quite a bit in that short amount of time. And at this point, I'm going to recommend it. I think the price is okay for what you get. And it is definitely a good option. I mean, it didn't cost any more than this thing. And that's about it, you guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.